Here in the Sun City, that's what we're going to be forecasting, a high of 99 degrees. We're going to be looking in those winds 5 to 10 miles per hour west and then southwest later in the afternoon going into the evening. Right now, 77 degrees. Sticky start though out there, not just in Rio Dosa, but here as well, up in mm -hmm. Las Cruces as well. After those showers moved in last night, definitely going to be a sweaty day, I think. Today. Yeah, the humidity is going to be pretty high. You can see humidity 58 here in El Paso. Las Cruces though, 71 degrees, 72 percent. Southwest winds, three miles per hour. Rio Dosa, going back to that, we're going to be looking into 59 degrees with seven miles per hour west winds. So 82 percent. So yeah, pretty sticky, I should say. Yeah, it's not. That's what gets me everything. Uh -huh. Right, the, it and everybody says this, so I'm not the first person to say this, but it when it's hot here in El Paso, mm -hmm. it's not nice, but it's doable. Once yeah. you get to like 82% humidity, like you see in Ridoso, and it gets to be like 85 degrees, a lot of people tell you that's worse than it being yeah, 105. Yeah, I just stay indoors. Yeah, at I that just point, stay just, stay just stay in the stay, AC. Just stay in the AC <laughs> and make sure to stay hydrated because we're even though we're not looking at triple digits today, we're going to still look at very hot temperatures. Now, scattered showers and thunderstorms are expected across the borderland. Here in El Paso, not so much from what it looks like right now in our radar, but we're going to see it more down towards Socorro. So keep that in mind when you're heading outdoors. You might see some sprinkles out on your windshields, but right now we're going to be looking into those upper 70s as well as upper 60s in Deming. Yeah, not too bad. 71 up in Las Cruces this morning, like we saw 54 as they get their morning started in Cloudcroft and then 73 down in Van Hoor on the west side. Low 70s this morning here over in Mesilla Valley. That's going to lead to a bit of a lower El Paso Honda Golf Index for the day, though. It's a touch cooler, but those winds picking up just a touch. And that affects it the most. We're giving it an eight today.